major revelation today in a Kenosha County cold case that's been unsolved for more than 30 years. Investigators now know the name of a man found dead near the Wisconsin Illinois border in 1993. Now the case turns to solving the mystery of how that man died. After more than three decades, Ronald Lewis Dodge is finally laid to rest. His body found 31 years ago today along train tracks in Pleasant Prairie, not far from the state line. A mystery Kenosha County Medical Examiner Patrice Hall would not let go. Everybody deserves to have their name returned to him. And um, you know, as I mentioned, I've been an investigator for almost 20 years now, and it's it's just something in me that I just have a drive to I just keep going. <laughs> Investigators reopened Dodge's case in 2014 when they took a new look at a skull kept as evidence. In 2017, this reconstruction was made of what the person could have looked like. It turned out to be an uncanny match with who we now know is Ronnie Dodge. Last year, it was a new lead from DNA that set the case moving again, positively identifying the remains as Dodge. Born in Kashina in 1952, into a family of 13 brothers and sisters. After decades of searching and praying, we were finally able to bring him home and lay him to rest amongst our ancestors. Dodge was a missing member of the Menominee Nation. His remains now returned to his people's land, giving that community a little bit of peace. This has brought some much needed closure for the family and our tribe. Moments like this highlight the tragic reality that our people and relatives throughout Indian country unfortunately know all too well. The ongoing crisis of missing and murdered indigenous people. Dodge's body was found with a gunshot wound. Again, how he died is still a mystery. If you have any information, you are asked to call Kenosha Area Crime Stoppers, their number 262-656-7333.